Mic one, mic one, mic one. Mic two, mic two, mic two. Any little time could just be standing in a line But then I get to thinking about the time When you loved me And every little time I'll cry I notice every set of eyes Looks to the ground do continuity the checks on these RF. A heart can break at any little time at One, two. any little time A stranger's life gets in my mind Recalling just the middle of a joke one, two. You once told me. And every little time I'll cry. It mystifies the happy guy. One, two. The reason why. One, two. My heart can break at any little time. Fears come. Tears come. Let them flow. Any little time could be the bottom of the night Or in the highest end in what men do If you don't love me Then every little time I'll cry And all the monks and all the umps Will know for sure I'm in the dumps A heart can break at any little time One, two. Tears come, let them flow. Check one, two, RF number one. Check one, two, RF number one. Check one, two. Check one, two. If you don't love me, then every little time I'll cry. Monks and all the ums can only laugh at such a chunk. The Nepalese will say please and ask me tactfully to leave. Another foul into the stands is like a subtle reprimand. A heart can break, and then the dime can break, and it can all just happen at any little time. In a little while from now, if I'm not feeling any less sour, I promise myself to treat myself and visit a nearby town. Standing at the top. Throw myself off in an effort to make it clear to whoever just what it's like when you're shattered, left standing in the lurch in a church where people say, My God, that stuff she stood him up. No point in us remaining, we may as well go home. Cause I did all my own alone again. And naturally, 
to think that only yesterday I was cheerful, bright, and gay. Looking forward to who would do the words I was about to say. And as if to knock One, down, two. reality came around. And without so much as a mid touch, cut me into little pieces, leaving me to doubt all about God and His mercy. For if He really does exist, then why did He deserve me? One, two, one, two, two, eight, eight. Truly, am indeed alone again, and naturally. One, two, hey, 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 hey. Over the years, and whatever else that appears, I remember I cried when my father died, never wishing to hide the tears. And at 65 years old, my mother, God rest her soul, couldn't understand why the only man she had ever loved had been taken, leaving her to start. With a heart so badly broken Despite encouragement from me No words were ever spoken When she passed away I cried and cried all day Alone again Alone naturally
It's going my way on such a fine day. It's gonna be all right. The sun is shining. I'm getting closer. Oh, how I miss just to hold you tight and see your smile. Just to see your smile. Such a long way and such a long time since I've been in your sweet embrace. Now, just a short time, I see the skyline. I'm home again. Since I've been in your sweet embrace, now just a short time, I see the skyline. I'm home again. It's going my way on such a fine day. It's gonna be alright. The sun is shining. I saw a silver lining. No, oh, my darling, today's the day. Oh my darling, today's the day. Oh my darling, today's the day I'm coming home to you.
not as clear as day. I'm not giving up on this one. Might as well be long. Oh, it's still too soon to say. I'm not giving up on this one. Whatever keeps me hanging on. Check, check. 
Morning, everybody. We're not getting started, but I just wanted to uh, ask anybody who's in the bleachers. I know it's a little bit tight in here, but if you can squeeze in one person, one seat. We counted for one person, one seat. So if you guys are spread out at all in the bleachers, I'm going to ask you guys to make sure you're just in that one seat so we can fit everybody as people are still coming in. I want to be happy, but I won't be happy till I make you happy too. I want to be happy, but I won't be happy till I make you happy too. Life's really worth living when we are mirth giving. Why can't I give some to you? When skies are gray and you say you are blue, I'll send the sun smiling through. I want to be happy, but I won't be happy till I make you happy. Then I'll be happy too. Also, if you are seated on the floor in a chair, can you please not leave any empty chair spaces? We are at capacity, so please make sure you're moved down and fill in all the empty chairs. Is it an earthquake or oh, simply a shock? Is it the good title soup or merely the mug? Is it a cocktail, this feeling of joy? Or is what I feel the real? McCoy Is it for our time or simply a loss? Is it Granada I see or Asbury Park? Is it a fancy not wild? Thinking of, or is it at last? Last, is it an earthquake or simply a shock? Is it the good title set or merely the man? Is it a cocktail, this feeling of joy, or is what I feel the real McCoy? Is it for our time, or simply a lie? Is it Granada I see? Or as very punk, is it a fancy not way thinking of, or is it at long last? Is it at long last? last? I've been singing all day, singing all night, singing cause I got this feeling and I know it's a mighty hard road, but we all gotta go, yeah we all gotta go. 
Moaning through the nights, moaning through the days, moaning cause I once had a love and now she's gone. But don't you know she's gone? But don't you know she's gone? And she ain't coming back. Laughing through the nights, crying through the days, losing my mind one tear at a time over you. It's all over you, mm-hmm. over you, a girl I wish you knew. Who was in the right, who was in the wrong, who could have known it would all come tumbling down. Mm-hmm. What a sound, girl, what a sound. When it hit the ground in trouble feeling around with a pretty woman she said that she was all alone and that i could come by her home she went out to lunch with me and a couple of times i took her out to see a movie or two and never ever thinking that she would do that to me every morning yes every evening I used to call her on the phone and tell her just how much I wanted her so. And there was no mistake, my heart would surely break if she should have to say goodbye. My, why? I thought I'd die. I could not survive without her tender caress and her sweet loveliness. I'm a fool, I confess. I'm telling you that she just left one evening. The woman didn't even say she's leaving. I went to my house to take her to a dance We were going to have a steak when I knocked upon the door There wasn't no answer Not in the morning, don't you know I'd never ever thought about standing around and waiting She was halfway out of town I figured maybe she'd go out to the store to get a couple things she needed Because she'd not wait around I said, I'm not instead of smoking cigarette I just knew that she'd be back plenty of time The first thing I knew an hour then two and then three went by All my cigarettes were gone I was wondering to myself What in the world has happened? When a lady from next door come up to me and said, I know you the fellow has been coming around. I don't know how this is going to sound. But Virginia's out of town. She told me to tell you that she won't be back. She's gone. I put a lover to get married. Why in the world is she doing? I could have did oh so much for her. Oh, well, I guess there is no use to think about it. I got myself a new girl and she swear that she's mine. <laughs> That song was disappointed, yes, indeed. At words poetic, I'm so pathetic. That I always have found it best Instead of getting them off my chest To let them rest unexpressed I hate parading my serenading As I'll probably miss a ball But if this ditty is not so pretty at least it'll tell you how great you are you're the top you're the coliseum you're the top you're the Louvre museum 
You're a melody from a symphony by Strauss. You're a Fendel fan of the Shakespeare sonnet. You're Mickey Mouse. You're the Nile. You're the Tower of Pisa. You're the smile on the Mona Lisa. I'm a worthless check, a total wreck, a flop. But if, baby, I'm the bottom, you're the top. You're the top. You're Mahatma Gandhi. You're the top. You're Napoleon Brandy. You're the purple light of a summer night in Spain. You're the National Gallery, you're Garbo Salary, you're Stella Fame. You're sublime, you're a turkey dinner, you're the time of the Derby winner. I'm a toy balloon that's faded soon to pop. But if, baby, I'm the bottom, you're the top. Five days of waiting ahead Five days to anticipate Days while my heart must wait Cause here it is Monday again Two days that raise like a whirlwind the next five will creep one by one Five days while I'll reminisce Reliving every kiss Cause here it is Monday again When it seems that the weekend's only starting Then suddenly it's time to say goodbye And we know that the time Has come for parting With just a word A touch A sigh Oh my Someday each day Will be heaven Someday, but heaven knows when Then you'll be completely mine But in the meantime Here it is Monday again Someday each day will be heaven Someday but heaven knows when Then you'll be completely mine But in the meantime Here it is Monday again Monday again You hit the spot Like a balmy breeze On a night in May You hit the spot 
pop like a cool mint tulip on a summer day. You hit a new high in my estimation. I had to fall. Cause you got so much on the ball. Oh, you hit the spot like the first embrace when the night is tight. You hit the spot. Like a pipe and slip by fireside. Matter of fact, we don't know exactly what it is that you got. But ooh, ooh, ooh you ooh, ooh, hit the spot. Ladies and gentlemen, we're about to get started. If you can, once again, if you're seated in the on the floor in chairs, if you could just move down and make sure you're making use of all of the seats. We still have a few people coming in, and if you're in the bleachers, if you could also move down and make sure that you are all taking in one seat and leaving room for anybody else who is arriving. And we will get started shortly.
the law forbids it, but let's do it all the same. Darling, let's make love on this plane. You come to know me between Washington and Spain. Darling, let's make love on this plane. When a Wilbur pulled on his center stick and gently took to flight, sweet of a good tree, his older brother ride. With clouds beneath us and our engines all aflame, darling. Let's make love on this bum da do do yazo ba da do ba do yo da ba do ba da ne do la da ba do ba ya ba do da do ba ba do 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 ya ba ba do ba do da ba do ya do ba ya ba do da do da do da. Ba da da do ya ba 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 ya ba ba da da. Ba 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 da ba ya ba ya da ba da do da da ba da da do ya ba ba da do da do da do da do old landy up straight to gay Paris in thirty hours flat. If he had company, he would never rush like that. This cabin shaking. Let's start taking off the plane, oh darling. Let's make love on this plane, oh oh darling. Let's make love on this plane. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I'm just going to go over some of the housekeeping stuff before we get started. If you could please turn off all cell phones or put them on silent so that we don't have them ringing during our ceremony. Photographs of the graduates receiving their diplomas. And at the step and repeat, they will be taken by our photographers here, and a digital copy will be sent to you via email for free or to the child for free. Um, we also have the live stream going on, and once the stream is done, that video will also be posted online for you to view as well. Um, I don't see any, but I do have to say no balloons. I don't see any balloons, so thank you very much for not bringing those. After the ceremony, we are going to have our graduates recess which means the recessional will um, have the students exit out to the cafeteria. Once the students have recessed, we're going to ask, well, during that time, we're going to ask everyone to remain seated until the recessional is over. And then once the recessional is over, the students have left, we're going to ask everyone to head straight to the exits uh, because we don't have the capacity to fit everyone into the school building in the different areas. So after the graduates leave, we're going to ask everyone to exit, and then the graduates will meet you outside um, and then they will depart from there. And the final thing is that this is actually blank, a little secret. Their diploma will be, will be given to them tomorrow. Tomorrow's the 180th day of school. They can't receive their diploma until the last day of school. So if, uh, if they come to school tomorrow, they'll receive their diploma in their phys ed classes, okay? So if you do take any photos with the students, don't ask them to open this up because there's nothing in it. Thank you. 
Good afternoon, graduates, family, friends, and faculty. Thank you for joining us to celebrate this wonderful and momentous day. I have the great privilege of welcoming you to the commencement ceremony for High Tech High School's class of 2023. I would like to ask Michelle Carpio, Megan Collado, Olivia Akenum, Jacqueline Lyris, Crystal Mack, and Gianna Scalcione to lead us in the singing of our national anthem. Everyone, please stand. So proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleaming, whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight or the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming and the it's red That's how you start a ceremony. I gotta follow that up. At this time, I'd like to ask Julianne Cartagena to lead us in the Pledge of Allegiance. Julianne resides in Jersey City and is graduating from High Tech's Media and Visual Arts Academy, where she majored in Broadcasting Technology with Mr. DePiro. She will be attending John Jay College in the fall, where she will be pursuing a major in Forensic Psychology. Please welcome Julianne to the stage. I pledge allegiance to the flag 
of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. Everyone, please be seated. It is now time for our first senior reflection. Representing the class of 2023 is Hisham Bamba. Hisham is, yes. Hisham is an industrial design major in our Design and Fabrication Academy. He resides in Jersey City and plans to attend New Jersey City University where he will pursue a degree in computer science. Good morning, fellow graduates, family, friends, faculty, staff, Principal Young, Vice Principal Ra, Superintendent Amy Lynn Rodriguez, and the Board of Education members. I am truly honored to have been chosen to stand before you today as we mark the end of such an essential and incredible chapter of our lives. I look out into the crowd and see not only my classmates who I have created unforgettable memories with, but I see 300 young adults who have overcome countless obstacles and have grown into remarkable people who will soon be receiving their diplomas. Let's give a round of applause to all the exceptional students sitting before us today. <laughs> High school has been a roller coaster of emotions, challenges, and growth. We have juggled the social, financial, and familial aspects of our lives, all while maintaining focus on our education. Our experience has tested our intelligence, time management, and mental health. The unprecedented COVID-19 pandemic disrupted our routines and forced us into remote learning and substantial self-reflection. High school has pushed us to our limits, but look around. We're all here, right? We have what it takes to conquer these hurdles due to the perseverance and determination we have, guiding us towards success and a fulfilled future. Perseverance is not just about conquering obstacles. It is about the persistent commitment to your aspirations, even when hardship arises, and the determination to reach the goals you set for yourself. Pursue your dreams with confidence and optimism and allow your hard work to drive you to success our perseverance and hard work brought us here, and let us use that same perseverance to create a positive impact on the world. I would also, oh, the future is scary. Growing up is scary. We will soon have to face the responsibilities that come with adult life. Though, as we bid farewell to our high school years, we have to remember that adulthood is not just limited to taxes and bills. This transition brings us independence and endless exciting possibilities. We are strong students, able to overcome anything that comes our way. So define yourself through your potential for greatness, not your fears of what might come next. Let's head, oops, sorry. Let's head towards the future with open arms and an open mind. As we say goodbye to scanning our IDs, the infamous morning megaphone, and waiting for that three o'clock bell at the end of the day, Remember that summer is here. Without a strict high school schedule, it's the perfect time to discover hidden talents and pursue our passions and just to have fun. It's our time to create a final chapter of high school that is filled with joyous memories. On behalf of the class of 2023, I would also like to extend my heartfelt gratitude to everyone, present or not, who has consistently supported us and made all of this possible. Congratulations again, seniors and may our efforts bring only success. I'm gonna miss all of you guys so very much, and I wish for nothing but the best for everyone. I've watched everyone beside me grow into such amazing people, and I'm so excited to see where we are in just a couple of years. I'll miss you, class of 2023. Don't forget about me. Now I'd like to welcome our superintendent, Ms. Amy Lynn Rodriguez, to the stage for the superintendent's address. 
Ms. Lynn Rodriguez has been a lifelong educator who leads with the same philosophy that she began with as an educator, that the students come first. She reminds us of the value of career and technical education, that if you let young performers perform, engineers build, chefs cook, scientists inquire, and artists to create, that students will love school and excel in all areas. Please welcome to the stage our superintendent of schools, Ms. Amy Lynn Rodriguez. It is always so hard to give my welcome once we have such phenomenal student speakers. And Hisham, that was great. Thank you for addressing your class with your kind words. It is my pleasure to welcome our family, friends, and the supportive administration and staff to the Frank J. Gargiulo campus as we honor Hudson County Schools of Technology's High Tech High School class of 2023. Give it up for yourselves. Go ahead, it's fine. <laughs> I am blessed to serve as your superintendent who oversees all of our district schools and programs. What you may not know that prior to my tenure as the superintendent, I was the principal of a small middle school. So I also stand before you today as a proud mother because some of your fellow graduates who are sitting right next to you have actually been part of the HCST family for over seven years. Please hold applause. I'm going to call them and I would like you to stand up. Aris, Mohammed, Hannah, Daniela, Ashanti, Daniel, Emily, Anthony, Amisha, Catherine, Karina, Ayeli, Hudson, Jessica, Cody, Kamanye, Angelina Malara, Miles, Mia, Alex, Sam, Miranda, Darius, Frankie, Josiah, Angelina, Henrik, Sky, and Anton. Please give them a round of applause. You may be seated. Congratulations. Graduates, today, as we stand on this threshold of a new chapter in your lives, I want you to remember the invaluable lessons you have learned at our career and technical high school. You've been given the tools not only to succeed in your future and academic endeavors, but also to excel in chosen careers. However, the most crucial element of your journey ahead is not just what you have learned, but who you chose to grow and learn with. This morning, it is my role to share with you the who, all of your supporters. And obviously, we wanna start with the people who continue to stand behind you and maybe on the sides for today, and that is your family and friends. Families, thank you for entrusting HCST to educate and nurture your children, whether it be for seven or four years. We will be here for a lifetime. There's also those from the HCST family you may interact with on a daily basis, and others who are behind the scenes but are here for your success. Our transportation services, bringing our students from all ends of the county. Our facilities director, Wayne Zitt. Our school safety specialist, John Shinnick. Sheriff Shaleri, the entire sheriff's officers, as well as our security and maintenance who keep our buildings safe and clean and I pride ourselves knowing that we have the most up-to-date facilities throughout the county. Our food services who keep us well-fed and the best selection of food in town in comparison to any public school, led by Chef Mario and Chef Danny Ward. And our technology department, who continues to keep us connected with the world. Even when the world tried to shut us out as HCST, we remain strong and together. 
your steadfast, dedicated teachers who have managed hundreds of personalities while trying to prepare you for the future of our community and forever caring about your achievements. The members of our child study team are dedicated school counselors who continue to work tirelessly for you and to advocate for your success. Our office staff here at the Frank J. Gargiulo campus and the graduation extraordinaire, Nicole Somic, who not only facilitates your daily needs, but the needs of your academy supervisors, Samantha Doria, who is not here today, but Ms. Justine Franco and Mr. Gregory Simon. They advocate to make your majors stronger. And of course, this is all under the leadership of your caring principal, Ms. Kathleen Young, who administers all of these operations with the well-experienced, well-planned, and well-spoken Mr. Mike Rahr on his megaphone and supportive William Coach Mate. <laughs> All of the team in this school collaborate with our central office staff. We have former supervisor, now director of curriculum and instruction, Steve Ricciardi, our director of career and technical ed, Alicia Abraham, our business administrator, Nicholas Fargo. And all of them work together with me to advocate for you, along with our nine HCST school board members from various parts of the county, who are guided by our president, John Manella from Bayonne, our board president, our former board president, Craig Guy from Jersey City, and our vice president, Hugo Cabrera from North Bergen, and our board secretary, Joseph M. Munez, who all collectively help our district to keep it on track, and they support policies and vote on personnel, instruction, and programs. And our school board works with your local mayors who encourage their community to take advantage of these great learning opportunities at HCST. And overseeing all of our county is a former educator, Thomas A. DeGees our county executive, he and the county commissioners, they vote on various initiatives to keep programs funded like this. And believe me, I know that this was a very long list, but I want the graduates to understand all of the HCST family that I named, because as a district, collectively, without the unity of our community, we would not exist. So I encourage you, when you are out there in the community, and you're making that difference. Remember all of the support and all of the people that go into helping you with daily operations, not only to educate you, but to care for you. So stop and say thank you to them. Tell these individuals, share your stories about how high school made an influence in your life and what your HCST diploma means to you. Because as you step forward, I want you to remember the who. In life and in education, we are defined by not only our individual efforts, but by the company that we keep. Surround yourself with people who challenge you, who inspire you, who share your passion for growth and knowledge. Seek out those who will embolden you, who will push you to reach new heights, and who will also stand by you when the journey gets tough. Find those who reflect the values that you cherish, the ambition that you body, embody, and most importantly, the curiosity that you've nurtured here at HCST. Congratulations, class of 2023. Many blessings. Now we have a special tribute that's a tradition at High Tech High School. Leading us in the Rose tribute is a student who's demonstrated unwavering commitment to High Tech, Diosmary Martinez. She resides in Hoboken and is a broadcasting major in our Media and Visual Arts Academy. In the fall, she will be attending Lincoln University where she will study computer science and entrepreneurship while also joining their, you know, wait, did I say that right? Oh, sorry. Where are you going? Where are you going? Stevens to study biology. Sorry, my speech was a little dated. Dios Mary Martinez.
Senior year embodies a stressful yet rewarding passage from high school to college. We're suddenly given an immersive amount of responsibility and experience the fortunes and hardships of growing up. As we embark on this new chapter in our lives, it's important to remember the people that have influenced us and shaped who we are today. Our family members who have been by our side since the very beginning, who have supported our passions and pushed us to persevere even in our moments of self-doubt. To our friends who have always been tolerant and understanding ears, who have comforted us and have brought joy and laughter into our lives, and to the teachers who have stepped up far beyond the classroom, those who turned into family and lifelong friends. I was always blessed enough to have an incredible family who has taught me that I can do whatever I set my mind to, as long as it makes me happy and I work hard. Whatever I needed in order to succeed, you would give to me, and I am forever grateful for the wisdom you have passed on to me. To my brother, who I, have, who I am following in the footsteps of, that has been more than supportive than I could have ever imagined, I really couldn't have asked for better. You have given me the foundation I needed in order to grow and have since ever like inspired me to never settle. You have consistently been there for me in every aspect. You inspire me to do what makes me happy no matter how difficult the journey may seem and to always keep my head up and dream big. We all have people in our lives who go to ends of the earth in order to see us thrive. And at this point in the ceremony, we'd like to pay tribute to all these people. Although we may never be able to thank you enough, after today's ceremony, we will... Be, we will be presenting you with a small token of gratitude for the infinite amount of love you share with us. Graduates, please stand and applaud for all your family and friends. All right, guys, you can be seated. Full disclaimer, Due to the budget, we only could afford one flower, so we'll finally get an answer to that question as to who is your favorite. Presenting our next senior reflection from the class of 2023 is Ayla Richardson. Ayla is a dance major in our Performing Arts Academy. She resides in Jersey City and plans to attend Northwestern University, where she will pursue a degree in cognitive science. Good morning, everyone. Good morning, fellow graduates, family, friends, faculty, staff, Principal Young, Vice Principal Ra, Superintendent Amy Lynn Rodriguez, and Board of Education members. Thank you all for being here today. I am so honored and grateful to speak with you. Today is a very special day. It is a day we've been waiting for. For the past four years, we have worried about forgetting our IDs, hearing Mr. Rivera and Mr. Raw on megaphones telling us that breakfast is over, and of course, setting for many exams and writing papers. But today we say goodbye to these familiar experiences. We say goodbye to high school and embark onto the next chapter of our lives. What our future will look like has a lot to do with the choices we make. Go left or go right. It depends on which path we take from the hundreds of opportunities that come before us. We are so filled with ideas and passions without a roadmap on how to get there. Our fellow graduates will be traveling nationally and internationally to pursue their dreams. I have made the decision to move to Illinois. Though it's a pretty big change, it's there to be afraid of. It's only a completely new environment, a completely new state, 12 hours away from everyone and everything I know and love. <laughs> Piece of cake. It's safe to say that I am terrified. I am sure every one of my fellow graduates is feeling the same. Yet we take the risk anyway, because what is life without risk? Along with our education, risk is our building block to achieving our desires. Every invention, every discovery, every success story was born out of risk. Daring into what is yet undiscovered is not about reckless behavior. It is about calculated leaps of faith. It's about acknowledging the possibility of failure, yet persevering in spite of it to reach your goals. Graduates, we are the architects of our own destinies. We now have the foundation and the skill sets that will help propel us forward into our future selves. However, it is our willingness to step into the unknown and our capability to embrace uncertainty that will determine the measure of our success. Then, and only then, are we able to unlock our full potential and accomplish our greatest dreams? 
We all have our own unique aspirations, our own ambitions we seek to fulfill. But dreams without actions are merely fantasies. It is the risk we take that turn these dreams into reality. Author Lewis Carroll, who wrote Alice in Wonderland, once said, in the end, we only regret the chances we didn't take. Success is not living in Wonderland. It lies outside the boundaries of fantasy. We must have the drive and determination to venture past those limits and step into our greatness. Yes, we are saying goodbye to what is familiar, but find the courage to try something new. Take those leaps of faith without fear. Pursue your passions and let them guide you. Dare and take a risk. Don't just dream. Congratulations, class of 2023. Our next adventure awaits. Thank you. Next, I'd like to welcome Ms. Kathy Young for the principal's address. Ms. Young has proven that the walls of adversity can be broken down by the collective efforts of those who are willing to come together for our students. In only her second year as high-tech principal, her commitment to our students' safety, well-being, and their education are a sign of great things to come for the future of high-tech high school. And if this year's success is any indication, then high-tech is headed toward even better days ahead. Please give a warm welcome to Principal Young. Class of 2023, give yourselves a round of applause. I am so proud of you. Everyone has given thanks to so many people, administrators, faculty, board members, loved ones, those here, those that support us, and those that are remembered. I wanna thank you for allowing the privilege of educating your children here at High Tech. In addition to all of the people that have been thanked, I won't repeat all of them because they've been repeated several times. I do want to acknowledge Mr. DePiro and his interns in the back. <laughs> Day, night, weekends, it doesn't matter. Him, his interns are always here to keep the memories alive with the videos that he does every single event that we have here. And we really do appreciate the talent that you have created in your students. So thank you. Students, this year, as you embark the class of 2023 on your chosen path, beginning adventures, furthering your education and life experiences, we can only hope that we have laid the foundation for you here at High Tech High School. This could not have happened without the support and encouragement of your parents, guardians, families, and friends. Mr. Ra, I do have to acknowledge your support and all that you do is so appreciated. I know that megaphone came up so much, but <laughs> you and Mr. Rivera are pretty popular. Thank you for your leadership to our supervisors, Ms. Franco, Ms. Doria, Mr. Simon, Mr. Ricciardi, thank you so much, Ms. Abraham for your leadership, and of course our superintendent, Ms. Amy Lynn Rodriguez. Please give them a round of applause. Students, your choice, whether DFAB, environmental, biomed, COLSI, or MVA, you have all shown vulnerability and how to reflect on yourselves. You have endured the pandemic, learning virtually, isolation, uncertainty, and you here sit before us celebrating your strengths, successes, and dreaming of your future to only what will be. Our experience with COVID was far from different from anything we could have imagined. I still remember the final days just before the shift to online classes. There were ongoing questions of how this will work. Will we be able to focus? We've gone from classroom to bedroom, school clothes to pajamas, no lunchroom, office visits, lunch table, detention. I'm sure you had a different detention at home. Friends nearby or close by were absolutely forbidden. We had to stand six feet apart, masked, but now we stand here with no masks, most of us, 
and some sense of normalcy, but it still lingers in the air and you have overcome all of those obstacles and you really need to be proud of yourselves for coming through those doors every single day and having the faith in our staff here, our superintendent who had allowed the doors open way before any other school gave us an opportunity to open the doors for students to come back. And I truly appreciate that. There were times some of you would wake up with additional responsibilities, maybe taking care of your siblings, preparing your own food while class was ongoing. Some didn't have internet and managed to get through. So many obstacles, locked down from social events and work, yet you are here today in person, back in school, but not the same, only stronger and better. I urge you though to put your phones away sometime and enjoy the little moments in life. I know that's difficult for a lot of you, we said, stay on your computers, stay on your phones for six and a half, seven hours. And now we're saying, put the phones away, get off the computer and talk to each other. Be thankful and grateful with the smaller things in life. Value your family and your traditions. My message to you is one that I've learned the hard way. Don't ever make decisions based on fear. Make decisions based on hope and possibility. If it doesn't challenge you, it doesn't change you. Be the change you wish to be in the world. I congratulate each and every one of you and families. Thank you so much for being here today. I appreciate your support. We could not do this without you. So thank you. Okay, this time I'd like to recognize some of the students who were selected for honors, awards, and scholarships. The recognitions signify outstanding performance and dedication to their respective fields and subjects. Earlier in the week, seniors attended an awards ceremony where winners were called on stage and presented with their awards. Academic Achievement Awards were given in the areas of mathematics, English, social studies, and science, as well as in CTE majors and world languages. Next, the Excellence Awards were presented to students in the areas of leadership, character, effort, and service. Also, five DFAB students earned their associate's degree in science and mathematics from Hudson County Community College, and six students received their associate's degree in environmental studies from Hudson County Community College as well. And finally, scholarship recipients were announced, including those presented by our own High Tech High School, our HCST Foundation, and the HCST Education Association. Will the recipients of these degrees, awards, and scholarships all stand to be recognized? Okay, guys, have a seat, have a seat, have a seat. Uh, so just before we get to calling names, uh, I just wanna take a minute to thank all the people who made not only this event, but this year possible for our seniors. Uh, so many people have already been mentioned. I'd like to reiterate our thanks as an administration to our Academy Supervisors, Ms. Doria, Mr. Simon, and Ms. Franco. I really, nothing happens in this building without them. I can't thank them enough for everything they do all year long. All our guidance counselors, child study team, nurses, secretaries, uh, Mr. Rivera and Ms. Bobby Joe in the attendance office, most of all to our teachers who work tirelessly to provide the best education possible for our students. Let's give everybody a round of applause for those. <clears throat> and for the smaller things that go on in a big way, a huge special thank you to our student government advisor, Ms. Urbano, our peer leadership advisor, Ms. Arias, our senior class advisors, Ms. Doria and Ms. Vargas. And I'd like to acknowledge some of the people that helped plan and execute everything for today. Um, Ms. Fernandez, Ms. Hanford, Ms. Castanon for doing the t-shirts and handing out bags. The PE department for when, when we decided to bring the show inside, not only was it the security and the maintenance staff helping out, our PE department helped set up all these chairs. Um, all of the maintenance and security obviously for today. I'd like to thank Mr. Guerrero and Senior Devin Marillo for designing the program and the event tickets. Yes, big applause for that. To Mr. Zisa for helping our seniors prepare for, to perform the national anthem, which was fantastic. Uh, to Mr. Falzone, um, Gennaro, Mo, everybody who helped out with all of the audio, and Mr. DePiro and all the video, thank you. 
Um, finally, I see her in the back there, Miss Samick in the high school office. She did so much to prepare for the ceremony from tickets, caps, gowns, programs, decorations, everything. Thank you to Miss Samick. Um, to Miss Franco and Miss Murphy for reading speeches and helping you guys prepare for all that. So all of these people chipped in. It's a big day. It's a big event. And without everybody's collective efforts, this, this day could not happen. So thank you to everybody who helped out. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is the moment you've all been waiting for. It's now time for the presentation of diplomas. Ms. Lynn Rodriguez, members of the Board of Education, honored guests, family, and friends. The following students have satisfactorily completed the course of instruction and have met all requirements at the Hudson County Schools of Technology and are hereby awarded their diploma. First row. Michelle Carpio. Say name. Come on. Megan Collado Rivas. Olivia Akanam. Jacqueline Lyris. Crystal Guadalupe Mack. Gianna Scalcione. Julianne Marie Cartagena. Hisham Bamba. Dios Mary Martinez. Ayla Richardson. Nancy Abdel Messiah. Mikaela Akob. Nyla Acosta. Michaela Augusto. Andrea Axamit. Alejandra Almanzar. Vincent Alvarado. George Alvarez. Julian Alvarez. Mohammed Amir. Aris Andes Phillips.
Jaslyn Emery Angelis. Alina Ardry. Samantha Arias. Madeline Renee Ash. Mohammed Asu. Francesca Jacqueline Aviles. Sarah Noemi Aswahe. Rita Batarelli. Erica Bailey. Isabella Barone. <laughs> Helen Yesenia Barrera. <laughs> Elias Barushin. <laughs> Jared Christian Bautista. Sophia Benevente Sayani. Oliver Bernal. James Beacom. Charlotta Blanky Chesova. William Bone. Jaden Bradley. Joseph Branco, Jr. Corinne Brown. Reagan Grace Burke. Penelope Burt. Nicholas Byers. Isaac Caicedo. Andrew Carpin. Emily Carpin. Hannah Rose Carter.
Michael Anthony Casayas. Jaden Alexander Casello. Kevin Lewis Castro. Valentina Castro. Miranda Cerrone. Denitza Chang. Yena Chang. Sanvi Chogale. Grace Conlin. Jazz Conlin. David Corquera. Daniela Correa. Jaden Cortez. Nancy Cortez. Natalia Carriolio. Ashanti Crockett. Benjamin Quadra. Emily Dadula. Daniel Daly. Adit Dasgupta. Leia De Los Santos. Tara Dean. Adrian De Los Santos. Emma DeZenzo. Esteban Diaz. Naya Isabella Diaz. Rafa Jang. Dominic DiNardo. Rokea Diop. Annalise Dominguez.
Sebastian Dominguez. Faze Ducali. Sarah Elizabeth Dazikin. Yasmina Saida Elmadi. Amal El Samak. Casey Estonilo. Yusra Ferris. Emma Sofia Fernandez Santino. Brandon Fernandez. Emily Fernandez. Michael John Fernandez. George Fernandez, Abali Cruz. Anthony Ferullo, Jr. Destiny Wilkes Figueroa. Paige Jolie Fitzgerald. Isabella Grace Fornataro. Sarah Nicole Francis. Nolan Boyd French. Jasmine Maria Fulgencio. Emily Claire Gajillan. Saranya Ganeshian. Amisha Christina Gangadin. Alexa Garcia. Ethan Garcia. Lourdes Nicole Garcia. Michaela Garcia. Solana Garcia. Catherine Gladback.
Sebastian Glazuski. Renee Goldfinger. Karina Gonzalez. Eliel Gonzalez. Jada Page Gonzalez. Aditi Garadia. Isabella Graves. Madison Gretchen Gray. Hannah Mia Gruyon. James Elias Gruyon. Julian Ray Guerra. Lucas Najib Guerrero Default. Chloe Golden. Gabriel Gercheski. Hector Gutierrez. Tatum Hartnett. Xavier Herrera. Marcus Heyman. Deandra Hollingsworth. Gordy Who. John Emil Hewn the fifth. Ayele Hyde. Kevin Inoazo. Breeze, Jackson, and Boya. Matthias, Jackson, Moore.
Kate Jensen. Imani Sierra Jeter. Natalia Camille Jones. Naya Carameros. Isabella Mia Kasmer. Sifty Core. Mohammed Kayed. Kiran Kellahan. Cameron Kelly. Hudson Kotka. Kevin Hyun Kim. Gabriel Kobe. Brendan Konigsberg. Goss Kosgi. Brian Krasnoff. John Peter Kubowitz. Kushi Lakra. Michaela Isabella Lamar. Kayla Lavalette. Camilla Lemus. Milo Ross Lemus. David Lignowski. Danielle Liriano. Noah Loasis. Samuel Lobu. Leon Ovidio Londoño. Emily Lonero.
Jasmine Liu. Bishoy Makar. Andrew Maldonado. Jessica Malik. Giovanna Erica Mankizi. Steven Mangadid. Sila Maple. Esteban Augustus Marenko. Cody Marsh. Elijah Abraham Martinez. Sarah Martinez. Cassie Mayer. Kamanye Amor Mays. Grace McKenna. Angelina Malera. Angelina Marie Manaya. Tatiana Miranda. Haley Mystery. Ethan Modica. Evelyn Monzone. Miles Morales. Olivia Maria Moran. Richard Stephen Marrera. Melanie Morejon. Sol Moreno. Gabrielle Sabria Morton. Yaeli Munoz. Devin Marillo. Mariam C.D. Jai. Mia Faith Naranjo.
Nicole Nashid. Taha Nazar. Colin James O'Mara. Robert Ochoa. Mia Christina Oliver. Emily Olson. Sean Orifice. Camille Orozco. Phoenix Overholzer. Caitlin Pack. Joshua Palacio. Lucia Pardo Rea. Ayushi Patel. Priya Patel. Shruni Patel. Vidi Patel. You Patel. Daniel Paternina Jr. Avery Jade Pena. Juliet Pena. Jade Idali Pena. Sebastian Perez. Alexandra Pewitt. Kang Pham. Myra Padar. Pia Poma Askey. Alexander Potts. Nitsa Casada.
Krisha, Kiani, Ramchandani. Anthony, Ryan, Ramirez. Alyssa, Brenda, Ramos. Jamie Seloani Ramos. Sydney Julie Rampersad. Jillian Ann Real. Jalen Reese. Karina Reyes. Mark Andrew Reyes Macliff. Sabella Danielle Riccio. Samantha J. Rice. Olivia Rich. Nair Rasan Riley. Derlin Angel Rivera. Caitlin Rivera. Mia Rivera. Miranda Robertson. Annalise Rodriguez. Ashley Rodriguez. Daniela Rodriguez. Jesse Edward Rodriguez. Gia Simone Rodriguez. Melanie Rodriguez. Olivia Ryan Rodriguez. Angel Rojas. Amelia Rokich.
Cassandra Roque. Emily Jane Rosowski. Alexa Rosano. Jacob Rosenberg. Skyler Tate and Ross. Jacob. Darius Jacob Rush. Abrar Jaheen Russell. Kenya signs Luria. Sajud Hadea Saleh. Angel Ray Salgado. Sanjana Samurai. Jan Mario Sanchez. Linda Sanchez. Adriana Santos. Angel Gabriel Santos. John Gabriel Santos. Nika Giselle Sawi. Frankie Vincent Saputo. Nicole Mariah Sarmiento. Jadalise Marie Saturia. Matez Mustafa Sayed. Jesse Schmidt. Eve Scully. Marie Sa. Rosemary Serrano. Jay Shaw. Varun Sharma.
Hannah Shibley. Sarah Shibley. Andrea Sigler. Justin Chet Singh. Saloni Singh. Muhadiya Rahi Siam. Violetta Soto Rule. Jake Stilla. Olivia Marie Stone. Roddick Joshua Saknundan. Melina Susano. Josiah Rafael Suspansky. Monica Haney Tamer. Sergio Tapia Jr. Amy Taza. Giovanna Tejada. Brianna Nicole Peace. Portia Tommaso. Angelina Marie Torres. Dylan Torres. Ashley Lynn Tosado. Davina Ty Tran. Adriana Troya. Nevin Juan Trueblood. Nicholas Sang. Jason Tu. Alyssa Teresa Urbanski. Luciana Usa. Zachary Uter. Nina Wee.
Henrik Van Tassel. Rosa Vargas. Louis Varone. Elizabeth Vasquez. Matthew Velasquez. Yolanda Michelle Veliz. Elena Maria Vodechko. Claire Valsimus. Neil Agreed, Gel Derbyas. Jemaya Narcella Waiters. Sophia Mestanza Waldron. Sky Celeste Warner. Michaela Washington. Alexandra White. Sydney White. Zaniah Khalees Williams. Anton Yakub. Benny Zhang. I figure my megaphone caught so much heat during this ceremony, I might as well bring it up with me. At this time, all graduates, please rise. Congratulations to the class of 2023. At this time, you may move your tassel from right to left. You are now graduates. Everyone, please remain seated. We must recess. Our graduates will begin recessing. Graduates, make sure you get your rows. Get your rows from underneath your chair. Audience members, please remain where you are until the recessional is over. Graduates will begin recessing.
the professional photos that were taken will be posted in July. Audience, please remain where you are until the recessional is over. Graduates, don't forget your flowers. So bring your good times and your laughter too. We gon' celebrate and party with you. Come on, let's celebrate. Let's all celebrate and have a good time. Yeah, yeah. Celebration. We gon' celebrate and have a good time. A 
singer in a smoky room. I smell a wine and cheap perfume. For a smile they can share the night, it goes on and on and on. All right, guests, we're going to ask you to exit out of the doors to either side of me on this wall, on the screen. If you guys could please make your way out of the school building through either door, to my left, to my right. We do not have the uh, ability to host families inside the school, so we are asking everyone to exit. Just the school building. My seat's been taken by some sunglasses, asking about a scar, and I know I gave it to you months ago. I know you're trying to forget, but between the drinks and subtle things, the holes in my apologies, you know, I'm trying hard to take it back. So if by the time the bar closes and you feel like falling down, I'll carry you home tonight. We are young. So let's set the world on fire. We can go brighter than the sun. Yeah. <laughs> 
Don't you know that there ain't no 